Good morning. So I often get asked about um, fasting or the best ways to lose weight. And what's interesting is quite often people might have this relationship with food where... Sorry, my face is like I'm beaming, isn't it? It's all this light. So where they have this relationship with food where they maybe have a cookie, have a piece of cake or something like that and they feel really guilty. Hi, Gratz. Really guilty about having it. And then they'll ask somebody like, should I try and do fasting or should I try and, I don't know, restrict carbs or this? And it almost comes from a diet culture and this background of good and bad foods and you shouldn't eat X and Y and Z. And the issue with that is to step back and think, are you in the right position to go extreme, aggressive with this weight loss diet or fasting if you know you've got issues with kind of feeling guilty about certain foods, would it be better to look at perhaps these good so-called or bad foods in the context of calories to help build a more positive relationship with this food? So for example, if you say this bad food, let's say it's a cookie, let's say every time you have that cookie that you feel guilty and you think, oh, I've screwed up, you know, my weight loss is going to stall. But let's say now you have a look at the calories and you notice that it's the same as, say, two apples. Not the end of the world. You can track it, you're in context, you can move on, get on with it. Maybe you need a time of doing that to prove to yourself that what you've been told in the past might not be correct and it might have actually created like a negative relationship with food. Once you've done that for a bit, maybe then's the time to use some other kind of strategies or tactics to help you create a calorie deficit and lose weight. Hope that helps. It was just on my mind because I was chatting to someone earlier about kind of positive, good, bad relationship with, with food and what they do when they eat certain foods, how they feel. Quite a big thing that's overlooked. Hope that helps. If you haven't got a copy of my free book, which I'm giving away for free at the moment, even though it's on Amazon, um, I'll put a link below. You can download that. Hope that helps. Have a good weekend. I'm off to the park soon with my daughter, not on my own be weird. So take care and speak soon.